Hello and welcome to Goa 365's English News Bulletin. I'm Maithili and these are the headlines. Parts of Goa saw floods after heavy rains lashed the state. Pockets in Valpoi, Bicholim saw waist deep water. Tourism Minister Rohan Kaute reiterates that jetties are for tourism after jetty policy comes under fire. After the fact that Sharao Mayam were seen literally littered with stray cattle was highlighted by us. Madel Panchayat issues public notice over issue. Thank God for small mercies. And now for the news in detail. After potholes and drunk driving, stray cattle is another problem that has increased the number of accidents in the state. Despite numerous lives lost due to the issue, no authority has come forward to solve or even properly acknowledge it. Goa 365 has repeatedly been highlighting the roads of Sharao and Mayam littered with stray cattle, endangering locals commuting. However, the Madel Panchayat at Sharao has shown signs of life after they issued a public notice over the issue. Here's more. After repeated highlighting of the stray cattle menace in Sharao and Mayam, the Sharao Panchayat has taken note of it and issued a notice for locals. People are now hoping for some changes in the area. Watch. <laughs> Madel Sharao Gram Panchayat has issued a notice that should owners fail to remove the cattle from the streets seven days after the issue date of the notice, the cattle would be picked up and taken to a cow shed in Sikeri Maya. A vehicle carrying the message to has been doing the rounds in the village. Here's what locals had to say about it. ट गुरुन या गोरवांचे मालक जे असतात या गोरवांचे मालकांक दंड दिवपाची तजवीज या कायद्यान असत पण खचरूच या कायद्याची अंमलबजावणी केली वचना सुप्रीम कोर्टानही ही रस्त्यात गोरवा जी असा ही गोरवा बंदिस्त करपा खातीर सगळ्या ग्रामपंचायतींक आणि नगरपालिकेक बंधनकारक केलेले असा या गोरवां खातीर एक स्पेशल कोंडवाडो तयार करून ही सगळी गोरवां जी आसा ही गोरवां धरून व्हरून त्या कोंडवाड्यान दवरपास जाय अशी असो आदेश सुप्रीम कोर्टाचो आसा पण हेजेरूय खचरूच अंमलबजावणी केली वचना हालीच मय मतदारसंघातल्या चोडन माडेल पंचायतीन एक बरो निर्णय घेतलो आसा रस्त्यात गोरवां जी आसा ही गोरवां सात दिसा भितर संबंधित गोरवाच्या मालकांनी धरून आपल्या गोठ्यांनी दवरची ना तर सात दिसा उपरांत 
या सगळ्या रस्त्यात जी गोरवा भावतात त्या सगळ्या गोरवांक धरून गोमंतक गो सेवा यांचे गो शाळेन व्हरून दवरतले असं आदेश चोडन माडेल पंचायतीचे सरपंच पंढरीनाथ वेर्णेकर यांच्यानी काढलेला आहे या आदेशाचे आम्ही स्वागत करतात असो निर्णय खरं म्हटल्यास सगळ्या पंचायतींनी घेऊपाक जाय आज आम्ही मयान जर तर पळयत जाल्यार वचत थंय गोरवां रस्त्यार बसलेली आमकां दिश्टी पडटात एका लागून सगळ्या वाटेक शेण असतात आणि या शेणाचेर निसरून कितलेशेच वाहन चालक जे असतात हे पडलेले असतात जवार बर्वे फॉर गोवा थ्री सिक्स्टी फाय फ्रॉम शराव मये द मीडिया इज लुजिंग इट्स क्रेडिबिलिटी सेस फॉर्मर सी एम दिगंबर कामत आफ्टर बिंग क्वेश्चन ऑन इज इंडक्शन इन टू द कॅबिनेट हवेवर इट मे बी रिकॉल दॅट दिगंबर हॅड ऑल्सो डिनाईड जॉयनिंग द बी जे पी वेन न्यूज ऑफ द मास डिफेक्शन हॅड इनिशियली ब्रोकन हिअर्स मोर अँकर The media is losing its credibility, says former Chief Minister Digambar Kamat after being questioned on his induction into the cabinet. However, it may be recalled that Digambar had also denied joining the BJP but ultimately joined it after breaking the Congress. Here's more. View 1. While the minister has denied claims of a cabinet reshuffle holding the media responsible for spreading the rumors, it may be recalled that when rumors of the mass defection had begun, we'd heard a similar denial of the claim. While there is no official confirmation of a reshuffle sources in the know claim that the gumbers joining the cabinet is imminent uh, he has come but he has not met any of us this is the first time he is meeting all of us after we had joined so he came and told us that this is a party which works united so all of us have to work together sir uh, क्रेडिबिलिटी मीडिया इज लुजिंग दॅट क्रेडिबिलिटी बाय लुजिंग हा तांकां पहिले सांगले प्रेस एअरपोर्टाचे की हा राजकोट वता स्विमिंग नॅशनल सांगले तरी आता ना थोडे जण म्हणतात हा राजकोटच्यान दिल्ली गेलो किते तरी क्रेडिबिलिटी एस्टाब्लिश करा मरे लाईक दिस युअर क्रेडिबिलिटी विल लूज सर बट हे रुमर्स मागीर खरं जाता न्हू बीजेपी वचला जाल्यार तुम्हाला सांगलं जेव्हा डिसिजन घेतला सांगतो पहिली ना पहिली ना म्हटलेलं पहिली हा कसे पहिली हा कसे सांगतो असे जावचे ना न्हू अचानक तुम्ही मिनिस्टर झाले आणि मिनिस्टर म्हणून आमच्या मुखार येले झाले अमर शवारिया फॉर गोवा थ्री सिक्स्टी फाय फ्रॉम पॅनजिम विल टेक अ शॉर्ट ब्रेक स्टे विथ अस वेलकम बॅक द टुरिझम मिनिस्टर डज नॉट नो हाऊ टू फॉर्म्युलेट पॉलिसीज फॉर द पीपल ऑफ गोवा सेड प्रोटेस्टर्स डिमांडिंग दॅट द गवर्नमेंट टू स्क्रॅप द टू थाउजंड ट्वेंटी टू जेटी पॉलिसी हावेवर The tourism minister Rohan Khaute says that the jetty policy is only for tourism activities. Here are the details. Jetty policy 2022. Bangla. Jetty policy 2022. Bangla. Sizalami jetties. Bangla. Sizalami jetties. Bangla. Siopi jetties. Bangla. Siopi jetties. Bangla. Gold jetties. Bangla. Gold jetties. Bangla. Sagarmala policy. Bangla. Sagarmala programs. Bangla. Sagarmala master plan. Bangla. MPD jurisdiction. Bangla. MPD port limits. Bangla. Major port act 2021. Bangla. National waterways act 2016. Bangla. Project of three linear project. Bangla. Road government agreements. Bangla. Road government MOUs. Bangla. Citizen peace for port limits. Bangla. Tourism cluster of Goa. Bangla. इलेक्शन पहिले देवा कडेन सोपूत घेतात ते At the same time, the Osara Dolo Mottak, he got Tanchi, 
हाकान पीपल डोट ट्रस्ट यू मगता गोयकार सरकार मगचे ब्यूरोक्रेट्स जे आगे मगचे कि जेटी पॉलिसी जी आती मार गोयकार खबर तुमका संगता जो एक शेकार आसो आज तो टूरिजम डिपार्टमेंट मिनिस्टर तो शेतान देवलो वो मनीस हा खबर ना गोयन कि आने पोई टूरिजम ये जेटीज तो को कोला खातीर ये जेटीज तुझे टूरिजम वाटले नदर मारिया बीच ये टूरिस्ट फॉरेनर्स जे ये एक दिना आता सगले भिगणाकार दिता तो कारण कि क्या गोयन खूब करप्शन करप्शन वाड़ेले आ दिशा शेकार ये करप्शन कोरीत आसा जो लैंड स्कैम आसा लैंड ग्रैबिंग आसा आता जेटीज ग्रैबिंग करूं लगलो टीसीपी मिनिस्टर टीसीपी मिनिस्टर टीसीपी मिनिस्टर टूरिजम डिपार्टमेंट टूरिजम मिनिस्टर टूरिजम मिनिस्टर नई जाए तुम्हें जेटीज नाका पॉलिसी काड़ान डस्टबीन घक कमी हि जी पॉलिसी आई हि खा गोयकार मगोंक ना खा गोयकार हि पॉलिसी तैयार के लिए ना हा पी सरकार भोगता डेवलपमेंट 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 रोन खवटे संगता डेवलपमेंटा गजाली अरे तुवे बीच विकला तो सगे लमाणे थे मसाजी चलता थे सैक चलता ड्रग्स चलता वॉटर स्पोर्ट्स का सब भाड़क दिल्ली संगता गोय रखते डोंगर सगले कट के अख्खे हिल कटिंग चल बीच कसले टूरिस्ट गोयन हाड़क सोता फोक्त फोक्त प्रॉपर्टी डिलिंग कर सगले डीलर सगले जितने आमदार आज हंगा पॉलिसी सपोर्ट करता है सगले डीलर आसा Here's what the tourism minister Rowan County said in reply to the protesters demanding scrapping of the jetty policy. He says that those who don't know the policy are the ones who oppose it and it is still open for another 15 days of scrutiny. Listen. Important as a ki je swatak tagnyanik samastat who are thinking that they know every subject should first know that we are sticking to our word of saying it is a tourism jetty policy. Jetty policy only meant for tourism activities. In the policy, there is no mention of coal. There is no mention of uh, fishing and allied services. A coal story there, but that why the going chalo kang disabled karta. I mean, legality in that hardu sotta. Hangka illegality zai ka na ka operation bata. And we are very clear. Minute we have kept that policy well and I chan ani ek pandra days up to 31st October we have kept it further draft uh, of the policy open to the public to come and share their sentiments. Everything. Amar Shwarya for Goa 365 from Panaji. October 14 is celebrated every year as World Standard Day with the aim of spreading awareness among consumers, regulators and industries about the importance of standardization in the global economy. This year, the awareness program was held at Margaon. Here are the details. Consumer Welfare Cell in collaboration with Goa Can celebrated World Standard Day at Government College of Commerce and Economics at Borda Margaon. by conducting awareness talks on consumer rights and responsibilities for quality control of goods and services in goa listen today is uh, 14th october world standards day and uh, we had a program here at uh, the government college of commerce and economics in borda margaon uh, wherein we had the opportunity to talk to students and uh, the teaching faculty about the challenges today that consumers face in ensuring the quality control of goods and services in goa uh, we were very pleased today because of the response of the students as uh, they are the young consumers and going by the slogan jago grahak jago uh, it's a great opportunity for students now to take up uh, action to improve the services and goods that are available in the market uh, there are so many complaints about fake goods adulterated goods uh, mrp being uh, you know uh, overcharging is going on and uh, cylinders are underweight the lpg services are not good the water supply electricity so we have covered a range of topics today and we are pleased that the consumers uh, uh, who are the students here in this college have shown a lot of interest and we are hopeful that the consumer welfare cell will do more programs 
of this nature in this college. We organized it because we wanted to make our students aware of the consumer rights under the Consumer Protection Act 2019 and we also wanted them to be responsible consumers. So we contacted the Goakan coordinator, uh, Mr. Roland Martins and uh, it happened on a very uh, large scale the program happened and we are very happy that our students and our teachers also attended the program along with our principal. Sandeep Twenkar for Goa 365 from Margao. Leaders of the BJP in the state seem to be at odds with each other over the renovation contract of Kala Academy. The party's spokesperson Savio Rodriguez raised questions over the non-tendering of the renovation work at Kala Academy, while the Art and Culture Minister vehemently dismisses any wrongdoings. Here's more. Art and Culture Minister Govind Gaudi, while speaking to the media, refused to acknowledge any wrongdoings in the tendering process of the renovation work at Kala Academy, citing that the cabinet had approved the nomination process for the work. The minister, quite distraught, questioned the reporters as to what exactly the allegation was. Again and again, I am telling you the same thing. It was a cabinet decision. So why then only to blame Govind Gaudi? Exactly, no. Exactly. Ata kona sare majhe bhi shayi nasa yastali. Mano jo sabhi kai gusti zala. Mano na manta na ki zada janna kanche pranje lagta bani. Tejo us log patar marta nahi re. Because it is not one discourse. Everybody, everybody, everybody. Are they? Are they? Pay the aao baake dona. Aao kona target bhi dona. Kya aao dikhoi ga? Kya target bhi dona? Kya maake khobar na? I don't know. Yeah, it is a cabinet a gaile ni. Cabinet has taken the decision. आता से जग जे जगह सगळे आरोप जाता तेका फुल कॅबिनेट रिस्पॉन्सिबल आहे एक एक गोष्ट कसले आरोप जाता आता जे कसले आरोप कसले जाता कला अकादमी चे जे टेंडर काढले फाय त्याच्या वेळेन जे आरोप चालले आहे स्पेशल कसले आरोप यू जस्ट स्पेसिफाय वन एलिगेशन तुमचा आता अजून तुमचे आरोप केला तुमचा तो किने 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 आरोप केला कला अकादमी विदाउट टेंडरिंग विदाउट टेंडरिंग किने आरोप आरोप किने कला अकादमी चे विदाउट टेंडरिंग आरोप किने व्हाट इज दैट व्हाट इज दैट लम सम अमाउंट सगळो अरे आरोप किने सांगा नी मका आरोप किने टेंडरिंग प्रोसेस किने अरे तेका उत्तर हांव देत तुका और परत परत दिता की टेंडरिंग करनासताना कॅबिनेट आक डिसिजन आशिल्ले की नॉमिनेशन रजिस्टर घे आणि आणि आरोप कसलो उरलो किने आरोप सांगा मरे तुम्ही मीडिया तुमका खबर ना व्हॉट इज द एलिगेशन व्हॉट इज द एलिगेशन यू जस्ट लेट मी नो अरे आई हैव क्लियर ईच एंड एवरीथिंग इन द असेंबली Whenever I am uh, sits with you, I have discussed everything. Then you are talking about only allegation. What is the allegation? Then why you are targeted? Wait, uh, uh, I don't know. Because this one, how targeted are you? Are you also saying that our jaya jada ka jaya phone lagta, tha jada ke paathor marta. Then kya ekade magale ke kam ekade bar dista sone. Then ke kam kar paak dhanna ekam chip paathor. So kya kuch tivi shayi nere? Then how ulupak shakana? I don't have that much answer of your question. However, the BJP spokesperson Savio Rodriguez questioned his own party over the process. While he says he isn't blaming anyone, he only seeks to answers as to why the contract was nominated instead of a tendering process that could allow for corruption. Please understand the BJP is a party that has always focused on non-corruption. Okay. And Prime Minister Modi has been working very hard on non-corruption. So, today when a person like me goes into say the William constituency, People are asking me, how come you have not raised this issue? You know, the, it was raised in the assembly, uh, he said Saar Jahan and all that. I am saying now we have the Directorate Vigilance Report. The Directorate Vigilance Report has asked the government to set up a committee to inquire. Inquire and let the people know the truth, that's all I am saying. Amar Chawarya for Goa 365 from Panjim. We'll take a short break. Stay with us. Welcome back. Now for the sports news. Day 3 of the FIFA Under-17 Women's World Cup saw two matches on Friday evening between Group A's USA and Brazil ending in a draw. And Group B's Nigeria and New Zealand with the former dominating with a thumping 4-0 win. Here's more. Two-time champions USA led with the first goal during the first half of the match, swiftly followed by Brazil neutralizing with a goal Five minutes later, both teams were evenly matched with USA having a slight edge over the former. 
Meanwhile, Nigeria secured a thumping victory over New Zealand with a four-goal lead. The African team dominated the match with over 70% possession. Bureau report Goa 365. Now for the weather. Heavy rains and flooding have been reported from many parts of Goa today. Pockets of Walpa and Bicholim are even submerged in waist-deep water. Here's more. A cyclonic circulation over the East Central Arabian Sea is behind the increasingly stormy weather we've been seeing in October. While it is expected to dissipate by the week's end, Goa will be on the receiving end of its effects through the period. There will be a gradual increase in thunder shower activity over the next three days and chances of flooding are very high. There is also a likelihood of cloud to ground lightning, so avoid open areas or standing under trees or other tall structures. The maximum and minimum temperatures on Saturday are expected to hover around 31 degrees Celsius and 24 degrees Celsius respectively. Thunderstorms forecast until 16th. IMD issues yellow alert warning for Goa till Sunday. Flooding is likely at many places due to heavy rains. Maximum and minimum temperatures on Saturday, 31 degrees Celsius and 24 degrees Celsius respectively. No warning sent out for boat owners. Bureau report, Goa 365 with inputs from IMD. With that, we have come to the end of this news bulletin. For more news and updates, log on to our website www.goa365.tv. Take care. Stay safe and keep watching Goa 365.